Hello YouTube. What you're watching was recorded live on Ustream.tv. I would tell you to go to my channel Inky Obsessions there to sign up, but we only have Ustream till August the 1st. So, um, yeah, they're going, they're going away unless you want to pay $100 a month for their service, which I do not think I'm going to do unless I win the lottery. So anyway, uh, I'm going to make a collage that I'm going to cut up into ATCs tonight. And I use those, I don't do artist trading cards to trade them. I just do them as a little thank you note um, that I put in my Etsy orders. So get my winders situated here. Like everything on the computer today is like not cooperating with me. Sheesh. Oh, you had a storm in uh, Omaha. Well, buddy, I know. It's, I looked at the radar and it was just like this little spot, but it's coming right for us. So anyway, let me look in my collage fodder drawers. And this kind of has all kind of colors in it. So um, I can... Uh, Thanks, Joan. I can use just about anything on here, I think. Any of my colors. Um, I had this page. What did I do with this? I painted, this was an under paper. I forget what the heck I painted with it. I think it was one of those inky canvases I did. Like the one Jody put in her book. Um, I don't know. And of course, every color will go, but that that's not great there, is it? Maybe I'll tear off this little punk and try to put that in somewhere. And then I have these, oops, some, uh, this was one of my last jelly prints from my last jelly print run that I did. These are on bond paper. Oh, what's on here? These are on uh, uh, regular printer paper that's black. Um, so it's easy to collage. I don't know. Let's look at that. Oh, this is kind of cool, too. These, you can see those PBO Dyna uh, paints in there. That one's kind of boring. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see what else I got in here. Maybe a little piece of that. I think Dave, Dave just went out the basement door. You going to try to mow? Yeah. Oh, is it raining already? Yeah. <laughs> it got you. That's what I yeah, thought. I just took over the out. It's going to be in a few minutes I get it back. Right. Yeah. Nice. Not so much. Yeah. That's all right. Uh, no, thanks, honey. I'm good. Hey, Dorothy. CB. Hey, Oakley's mom. <laughs> Hello, Oakley's aunt, CB. All right, I'm just, uh, I had this piece painted up from, I don't know, something sometime before. And that's uh, something to start on with. It's got just about every color in it. I'll try to use some of these jelly prints that I have stashed in here and I said it goes with everything, then I lay something on it and that doesn't go. Patty, how are the pups' paws? Oh my god. Ah, what a disaster, I'm telling you. I had, uh, they're better. Um, Oakley, we still put his boots on when we take him outside. We're trying to let air uh, get to him. Somebody sent me something with this tissue paper. Isn't that cool? I wish I know where that came from. Um. I wonder if this would um, go translucent. I might pull a little couple of those off of there and try that. You love being his aunt. <laughs> oh, I'm telling you, being his mother's killing you. Killing me. Little fart. He's cute as a button, though. Gosh darn, he's cute. Um, and he's getting, he's getting a lot better. He's in that ornery teenage stage, but he's pretty much housebroken now. Uh, we've only had one... PP accident recently, and he was really should have gone out. It was, it was like they always say, 
trainers say nowadays, if you if your puppy has a PP ax or any accident in the house, roll up a newspaper and then smack yourself in the head because it's your fault for not taking them out in time. <laughs> so, yeah. He's a cutie pie. So I have this marble piece. As I say, it goes with everything. I'm finding a few things that it doesn't go with. That kind of looks cool with this contrast here. Maybe I'll do something like that. Okay, I'm not watching chat so much while I got my face stuck in these drawers. Um, but no, he's really cute. He, he He's a cute little booger. I'm going to keep him. Touch and go there for a while, but I'm going to keep the little turd. I have some... Some shiny stuff that I embossed and then put daddy vans on so it's pretty clear. I might stick a couple of those in there. Oh, and now I'm getting ads. Because they no longer, even though I was paying $3.99 for no ads. Um, yeah, that's gone too. Thank you, Ustream, for being free for another month and so. And so. Oh, here's some. Maybe throw a little bit of this in there. I gotta have some black and white in there. Let's see here. Yeah. Oh, I got all this stuff up here. Oh, here's some of Joan's die cuts in there. Joan, I can need a whole spe separate cabinet for all the die cuts you. Eileen! Hi! Larlu! Eileen, I haven't seen you forever. I was so sorry to hear about your mom. I didn't know. until It was a couple days after, I guess, when I just happened to be streaming, which is unusual anymore. And uh, I was really sorry to hear about that. All right, let's see what else I got in my warm color drawer. Oh, this is my neutrals. Let's see. Oh, some of this has started to... Look at this. This was um, archival ink. Uh, I think, Eileen, I really think something that would do you a world of good is to come up to Maryland with us this year and take my last empty seat. I would love for you to get up here. Hey, Janet. Don't you guys think that's a good idea? So anyway, look what this has done over time of being in that drawer. Now, that's probably been in there months and months, maybe a year. But look how that's smeared. Interesting. Interesting. Let's call that... Um, Uh, I don't know. What am I going to call that? Grunge. <laughs> and I might... I know, Janet. I come up with one every once in a while. It's not often. I have some of these. Remember these skins I used to make? I have some of these in this drawer. Maybe I'll throw some of those on there. And I have this pokey dot. I'm going to throw this off. I'll right, rummage through this stuff. The sailors have been asking you on an annual basis, asking for you, Eileen, on an annual basis. The only way we've been able to stave them off is to throw CB to them. <laughs> okay, so let's. Oh my, I got a bunch of stuff out here now. What the hell am I going to do? So this, that's a straight line. But do I want to cover up that bright red? I don't think so. I hate to put a straight line on there. Oh, however, how about if I do this? If I go in and put this straight edge at two and a half, look how clever I am. Oh, patty, patty, patty. 
And how exact is that going to be? Then when I cut my first card, that'll be the straight line down there, right? <laughs> you going to get any smarter? I can't stand it. Of course, it just moved a little. But that's okay. I'll get a little... Uh, It might be a little stripe of the blue. Yeah, hey, you're crooked. It's a little crooked. Ah, shit. Well, it was a good idea. <laughs> we shall see how that works out. And these are watercolors on this. Um, on watercolor paper. So I expect some of this will start moving. This blue strip is acrylic. This was a, it wasn't a jelly print. It was a painted paper that I did. A little bit of this paint's coming off of my brush. I can see it smearing a little bit, but it's going to be under this, so I don't really care too much. Got a little pictograph in there and a little gold that matches the gold on here. All right. Hey, Chad. Thanks for joining last minute, guys. Cover up too much of that gold. This isn't so spectacular there. Maybe I'll just throw that there. Maybe that's what I'll do. And this is watercolor too. But watercolor or inks? No, this is inks. This is a piece of under paper that I saved from something. I think it was those canvases I did with the ink and the hot glue way back when. That seems forever ago. I guess it was. <laughs> oh, mercy. Let's see a couple of these. I'm if anybody knows where this came from, it came to me in, in some kind of happy mail or gift. I don't remember. Please tell me. Won't you please? Um, let's put some of these pink ones. And they're kind of far apart, so I'm gonna I'm gonna kind of tear them out individually. Ish. I'm not sure how well this tissue is going to disappear into the sunset. Oh, shit. Oops, I said the S word right off the bat. We're not even getting anywhere yet, and I'm dropping one. Oh, well. Where's this going to go? That's kind of pretty against... Oh, how about this lime green? Oh, look at you. Pop my eyes out, why don't you? Should I bring you in closer? Hang on. Xander, have you streamed yet since you've been back? From down under, I um, if you did, I missed it, uh, which is not surprising these days for me to miss anything. I want to put this over from the edge because I'm going to lose a little bit of. Uh, oh, that that goes on nice. It's oh hello, so far I'm wrinkling it. There we go. That disappeared into the background. Oh. <laughs> You're welcome, Janet. Wednesday night. Um, I go to my mom Wednesday night, but usually I'm back in a somewhat reasonable amount of time. Um, I like these. 
I need to know where they came from. I would get more of these if I knew. They're really, it's like foil on the tissue. Let's see if I can show you. See how shiny? Oh, that's nice. That's a good spot. I like to put it where it's a lot of contrast. You know, I like my, my little pops. Another one. No, it does poo poo, doesn't have the same effect as dropping the old S bomb. But, you know, that's how I talk, and sometimes I just am myself here, so. Shit happens, right? <laughs> oh, mercy. Oh crap, did I glue it down to my under paper? Upside down. There we go. Where are you going to go? On that hot orange piece right there, maybe? Oop. It's easy to uh, wrinkle up like foil is, too. I know, CB, I don't know. I did this months ago, playing with watercolors. and throwing the gold in there and splashing some silver. And it's just sat over here in the corner and I thought, well, I don't have much time. Maybe I'll just use this and get a little out of the box. Um, so this right down here, this is kind of washed out. That's not too spectacular. Maybe I'll put one of these on that area. Well, let's see. So we got two more newbies um, signed up and paid today to join us in Maryland. One is a local uh, girl. I don't know her, though. Um, she's in the Glen Burnie. Well, that doesn't mean anything to you guys. Uh, she's 10 or 15 minutes from me tags, depending on where in that area she lives. Um, so she won't be staying at the hotel, but she will be with us. And then one of the girls that I met um, when I was in uh, North Carolina in April when I went with Dave on his golf trip and I went to Jody Ole and Gene Kessler's um, studio in Bass. Um, we took a class with Jody Ole and we had a play day. And actually, I hung out with, um, her name's Kate, uh, Katie Lambert. I hung out with Katie and some of the other ladies there. And <laughs> we went to a dinner at a steakhouse. Oh my God, we were, it was seven or eight of us totally out of control. Totally out of control. And we had one lady drop out today, CB, by the way. She had a family crisis with a health crisis and she can't, she was a newbie and unfortunately she's got something going on where she can't make it. So that's, I feel bad about that for sure. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, we... Oh, my God. We were getting some looks in that steakhouse. They were not thrilled with me. Whew. But we had some good yucks, i got to tell you that. Let's see. How am I going to put this on here without mucking up everything? These real thin ones are tricky to glue down. You wouldn't think they would be. Well, I think they are. Maybe it's just me. Here, like so. This is really tricky. Hang on, I got to get something to make it a piece of deli and press it down like that. Oh, one more day left, Tam. 
Oh, shit. Look what I just did here. Oh, I said it again. Damn it. See? Not paying attention to this delicate paper. Let's see if I can save it. Ish. Save ish. <laughs> oh, my. Yeah, I sent out a note to the ones who, the girls who hadn't paid yet. Um, and nobody's late. It's just you have till July 1st. But I had a like an influx of people saying, hey, I want to go, I want to go, I want to go. And I didn't want to tell them no. Um, um, you know, so... I wanted to make sure my head count before I told anybody no is what I'm trying to say. I'm not really paying attention to myself. <laughs> Which, hmm. Okay, let's see what else we got here. I need to get some black and white in there. It's making me crazy that there's no black and white in there. So let's do, let's do something even if it's wrong. Um, I'm going to let this glue itself down to this mess. Clean there. All right, where are you going to go? I don't want to cover up too much good stuff. That's kind of bland right there. Let's go that way. I want that gold kind of swirl around it. Is it straight ish? And these I try to put on the matte medium in the direction of the stripes because I'm not I'm never sure if I did it with a laser printer or not so um, <laughs> all right I got boogers over over my fingers here where's my I need a um, I need a punch, a punch puncher. This is a good size. Oh, that's a, that's a big one right there. Try a couple of these and see what we get. Oh, jeez. Stepping on a plug. My wreck! Yeah, this is one of my favorites. And these have a little bit of spots on them from the um, uh, you know what's that stuff um, the daddy vans I'll need to keep those in a separate bin so as not to contaminate oh hey Orla are oh, you going to go see uh, Carrie give her my best want to drop this one on my toe. And I need to get a couple long skinny pieces. Let me go this way so I can get my stripes. I'm just going to use my, my scissors so I'll get my big ones out. I'm not worried about this whole thing being exactly straight because it's going to end up over a span of about, uh, I'm going to cut this one wider, three or four cards with the size, if I keep it this size, when I put it down. Let's see what we'll do. See how that brightens that up? Look at you. 
Oh, I don't want to cover up my um, little pictograph sticking out there. Let's go right about there. Sandra, did you get uh, set up for Ustream yet? Um, I had Stacy um, Stacy Evans, Pink Poodle. She PM'd me and said that when I go to get set up, if I needed any help, she'd be glad to help me. I'm sure she'd help you too. Um, Um, she streams every, or, or YouTube, does YouTube Live every week for hours and uh, has it mastered. So, and she said if you get a couple mods, they usually don't have too bad of a trouble with, with trolls like they used to when it was first a thing. This is kind of carnival looking to me, like got too many colors <laughs> but it is what it is that's what we're going with right now I'm gonna actually cut this one in half it's too thick because I don't want to cover up too much of this gold I know this is hanging over there but I'm gonna cut that off later Are you going to stay um, with Ustream? Is that after August 1st, Janet? Yeah, I plan. that's what I plan to do, too. Um, come this far. Might as well stick it in there. I wanted it. Hang on. <laughs> they politely ask you to leave. I'm pretty sure they're going to turn the lights out on August the 1st at 12.01 midnight. Bye bye. Oh, crap. I picked up the wrong brush. That's all right. Let me get some of these down here to give me some kind of a grid to work off some other stuff. Oop, what did I say? I was going to go with the black and white and I just went against it. I think these are laser though. Ugh. Hey, Gillian. Ah, uh, I need a. Huh? Where the hell are my baby wipes? That's not good. Not good. I'll dip a paper towel in some water and get these glue boogers off my fingers. I tried YouTube Live, I don't know, probably a year and a half ago messing with it when it first started coming out. And um, I did get set up on it, but that's when they were telling you you needed, um, what is it called, an encoder and all this stuff. Apparently you really don't need that. Uh, I don't know if ever you did need it or just now that you can do without it. I don't know. I don't know all the ins and outs. Where are you going to go? That needs to be broken up a little bit or something. We're going to put you in here. Will that lay right? Probably not. All right, well, we'll let you sit a while. 
We'll let you sit. Let's see what else I got over here. I remember this used to go on pretty cool. Let's have a look see when I can get out of this. And I can't find any more of this same polka dot stuff. I look every time I go on Michaels, they don't have it anymore. It was in a mixture of tissue that was like different size polka dots and stripes and such. Hmm. Nothing seems like it's flowing to me. Is it me? I don't know. I'm not feeling it. See what happens if we do that. Oh, crap. Get another clean piece of belly here. Right, that's a, that's a thing is you can't, I always, and I always tell everybody, you know, this is not going to be one piece of art. There's not going to be a focal point and I want to, I want to get as much on here as Uh, as I can because when I cut it up into ATC cards that's redundant isn't it ATCs or artist trading cards um, oop, come on my dang on hand I'm gonna have to wash my hands darn hands are so sticky Oh, that white over that foil, that's not good. Try to fold as much as I can over. But this one, I remember this went pretty transparent. This, uh, tissue. My brain locked there. Did you hear that? Just completely shut off. Um, let's see. I'm going to do some pictographs. There's some silver in here. So I'm going to use these silver ones. Maybe some of these ah, silver feathers. Oop. Come on, work with me. Get away from there. There we go. Chelsea just um, adopted a five year old female black lab. She is so sweet and calm, and um, of course the baby just loves her, and I'll have to show you guys a couple pictures of them together. It makes him look so tiny. And she said, they, they just had her, they picked her up yesterday, and last night she said she slept at Chelsea and Pete's foot of the bed then she moved to their doorway like and out in the hall 
so she was between the baby's room and their room and then when Pete left for work she moved out and she laid on top of the, the top of the staircase like she was going to be a barrier for anybody that tried to come up the stairs to where Chelsea and the baby were. <laughs> They're stubborn little varmints when your hands are all gluey. One more. Almost there. Sure, this is a blast to watch. But this is real life, people. This is what it's like when you're doing this stuff. It doesn't all magically just poof. It's on the page. Hang on. Let me show you this while I'm thinking about it because you know how that goes. You'll never see them. Here's what I like him standing looking out the front door with the dog stand. Well, the dog's black. You might not be able to see him very well. But look at his little teeny butt there with no shirt on. And there's the dog standing next to him. Of course, it's not going to focus. Hello, and it's on my camera, so it's shiny. Come on. There it goes. Look how big the dog looks. Compared to him. <laughs> oh. Here's another one. He likes to sit in this. It's a high chair. It's like a booster seat high chair that sits in a regular chair. Well, he likes to sit on the floor in that to sit and eat and watch on TV. So here he is in the kitchen on the floor. Um, and the dog didn't touch his food. He's sitting in his little seat and there she is. Land beside him dutifully. The TV's up and to the left. So there was another shot later where they realigned so they're both sitting there watching TV. <laughs> oh, God. I spent, I took last Monday off and spent the day with them, with her and the baby. That was fun. Okay, let's see here. Where are we going to put you, little pictographs? You're going to go somewhere because you have to. Didn't show up so good there, did it? No, it did not. Let's do this. Let's put this one. On top of this. I don't know. There we go. That shows up a little bit because it's a little darker. Which means I can put one up here on that other dark blue spot. Eileen, I'm serious. I think you should come with us in July. Will you consider it? Will you at least entertain it? Pretty please. Where are you gonna go, pictograph? Let's go right down the middle here. Let's go. Let's do that. Just because it's different. <laughs> I'm gonna put you. My chair's squeaky. Need to get some Earl out here. Oh, I know what I wanted to show you guys. It's right here, sitting right here next to me. Um, where the hell are my baby wipes? Sheesh. Yeah. Oh, 
crap. I forgot to change my pants. I've changed my shirt, but I forgot to change my pants. Um, I got this. I want to show you guys this. This is how it arrived. In this little very oriental looking box. And it's a chop that I had made um, with my PTP carved in it in, I guess, Chinese? Which way does it go? It goes this way. So that's the way it would look. Come on. There you go. And then this is a little container of red ink that you can use with it. But they suggest that this isn't really the best. They sold this one instead. And it's red. And it's like, it's red gummy like. Um, there's usually with those chops, it was traditional to use red ink. Um, I've actually used rose gold on it with it. <laughs> um, but anyway, uh, oh crap. Set it in the glue. It's no wonder I'm, everything's sticking to me. Um, but the thing is, hey, Glenda, um, the rough watercolor paper, I can't get a clear print in it. And it came with two pages of instructions. Uh, And it may tell me in here how to get a better imprint. I don't know. I'm not going to read it now. But here's where I got it from. Nan Ray. I saw her on Instagram. And then I went to her, linked to her website. She's got all kind of cool stuff out there. A lot of authentic uh, Chinese um, watercolor-y stuff. Oh, here's my imprint. There's what my imprint looks like. And it's not going to focus. But anyway, um, that's where it came from. It was not cheap. But I figure I'll have it forever. It'll work as long as I'm PTP. <laughs> I told Dave that. <laughs> I always say, I'll always be Tolly. I don't know how long I'm going to be a parish. You never know. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Just kidding. There's no issues. Love them to death. I'm going to cover up some of that right there with this. Try that. Cover up that little hole. CB, I could see you getting a chop. And I know you like that oriental kind of stuff from your previous life living over there. Thinking you should you should get one for your CB. Um, I'm not liking this at all. I gotta tell you, not a fan. Not a fan. Not yet. Maybe I'll get there. Currently, not a fan. Oh, you have one. Of course you do. Of course you do. Let me tear a piece of this. I don't know, skinny. Let's, let's try to get this little piece of turquoise right there. No, I called them today when they reopened. They, the, I knew when I left there that I thought it was going to be a problem. And I just, I wanted to try them in my own environment to see if there was any other issues other than the reading. And the distance is great. But the reading, yeah, not, like I couldn't do this with those glasses on. I wouldn't be able to see this clearly at all. Um, where are we going to put you? Ooh. 
Yeah, nothing's hitting me with this one. See, this is what happens when I work outside my color range that I I like. See, now I'm going to cover a pictograph if I do that. Cover up one there. Unless I tear this off. And tear this off. Maybe I can put it Crap, I don't want to cover those. And I don't want it too close to that one going the same way. Do I go this way? And then it's too close to that one. Ah! I'll go this way. I'll do this. And I'll cut that off right there. That's what I'll do. Patty, are your glasses true? I don't know what that is. They're progressives. They're not, if you mean trifocals, they're, they're progressive. They have 12 different viewing uh, areas all the way through them, and you don't see any lines in them, if that tells you anything. Is it me? Just at a glance. You know what I mean? I don't know. Hey, Debbie. Thank you for that information. By the way, that you sent. I appreciate it. A lot more into that than what I thought, but I did order some of the, um, what's that powder called? The car carbide stuff, and I got a I got the 10 inch glass plate. Um, so I'll be on my way here. All I got to do is carve out some time one of these years. Ooh, look at you. Pretty bright, shiny. PBO. It's all that green stuff. I need more black and white. Maybe that's what's screwing me up. Where? Maybe the round ones. Little round ones. Get some of you in there. Uh. Huh, huh, huh. Let's go this way. Yeah, Janet, I always have to keep in mind what Janet said. This isn't going to look the same when I cut it up into ATCs. Keep that in mind. Because <laughs> right now, I'm not a happy camper. I may not be later. I don't know. Will that even go on there? I don't think that'll glue right over top of that uh, cut out. I hate to cover the anchor. The anchor is one of my favorite pictographs because it's neat. Look at you, you slippery little rascal. Get down there. Get down there. Where did I put my paper towel? There we go. Um, yeah, I, I just, I not feeling it. Not feeling it. Um, Anybody ever sees any tissue like this, please let me know where you saw it. 
This is cool stuff. So these little whoops, foil circles on this tissue that pretty much just evaporates into nothing when you glue it down. Oops, we're off corner. That's all right. We'll stick it under something else. Where'd it go? Oh, here it is. All right. Now, a little bit of glue for you. This one I can put up against an edge somewhere. Where will that make the most impact? Against there. Against that coral down here, maybe? That was off the edge, but I put it just down against that coral color. That'll look pretty poppy. Poppin'. Poppin', poppin'. Oh, this whole thing needs help. I'm not... Uh, I should always go with my gut. Even though it pisses most of you off. <laughs> uh. Maybe I'm just out of practice doing these. I haven't done them forever. What's Darcy doing? Is she causing a ruckus? Ah, uh, crap. Come on. There we go. Um, where are you going to go? Something needs to be brighter in here. That's for sure. These are great little shiny bits. What am I humming? Some kind of Star Wars thing? I don't even like Star Wars. I don't even know if that was Star Wars. <laughs> I don't even know what I'm saying. <laughs> Kayla! How'd you sneak in the back door? How did that let that happen? I'm working on a piece of nothing right now. Where was I going to put that? Break a little bit of that up, maybe? I don't know. I'm not liking this. Not feeling it. Not feeling it. Let me see some of these little feathers here. I need somebody here like a sous chef to tear all this crap up and hand it to me. That's what I need. I wonder if I can get Dave to do that. <laughs> oh, you silly girl. You must be sniffing too much glue. He's a sport, but... If I'd have to move my whole desk, he would do that, but... Doing this little fine bits like this? Eh, not so much. I'm going to put you, where am I going to put you? I'm going to put you right there. <laughs> Prince, he's right here on my desk. I've got several princes. 
I haven't been feeding them lately. This is a messy sport. Which most people probably don't have that issue. I think it's more me. Watch, I can't stand this. Watch it come out my favorite one of all time when I'm done. That's stretch. <laughs> Kayla, you're just looking for bits for your shrine. <laughs> oh. Laurie Lou, there you go. I'm hoping within an hour I'll be eating a burger or something somewhere, somehow. Dave's grilling something. If the storm doesn't blow him away. Where are you going? A little feather. I don't want to put you straight up and down. Let's go. Let's go crazy and put you on the diagonal. What a wild woman. Hey, cat. Maybe if I get something. That's a wild. I don't know why I like that one so much. It's kind. Of, it was a cleanup print when I did my last jelly plating eye stencils thing, and it's just layers of muck that I picked up, but I like it. And I don't know why. Let's chew. I won't pop something in there. Oh man, I must find my baby wipes. Where the hell did I put them? Don't ever reorganize. Never find anything again. Paul wants a burger. Oh, there's a new place up at the mall now called Zen Burger. Do you guys have any Zen Burgers? Hey, Kathy. Have any Zen Burgers where you guys live? They're um, fresh made. The meat's never frozen. It's either Angus beef or Kobe beef or a blend. And they have a, they saute onions in uh, Zinfandel wine. And when you order onions on your burger, you get the red, you get the Zinfandel onions, which are spectacular. So it's kind of a high-end burger joint. We went there with my friend Gail and her husband, and everybody loved what they had. And they have these specialty milkshakes. I forget what I got, but of course I got one. And as much as I love ice cream and milkshakes, I wasn't a fan. It was really thin. I like a little meat to my milkshakes, you know what I mean? Oh, God, Gala, he's upstairs. He cannot be down here, like, on his own, like, to land on my desk or something. Never going to happen. Oh, no. Not yet. He's not there yet. <laughs> he's upstairs with Daddy. Hopefully with his little booties on. Did you see that? We can take you there, Joe. Um... Here's my little turd. Oops. Where'd you go, Okie Doke? There he is with his little booties on from his boo boos. See him? He's not thrilled. He's a handsome little fart, though. And look, here's his boo boo. -boo. One of his boo boos. See where that pulled his pad back? Yep. 
his back two paws and Babe's back two paws. And this was them the night we got them back from swimming. They were both exhausted. <laughs> yeah, meat shakes. You know, it's got more thickness, body to it. You feel like you're getting something. Getting something good. Um, well, I don't know. I don't know what I want to do. Let's try ripping a hunk of this somehow. The talking videos. I tell you what, when we do those, <laughs> well, I do them. Uh, but when we play them back in his voice, it has like a little synthesizer or something in the app where it, you can obviously change the voice. That's not me baby talking. That's, that's the app doing that. But <laughs> we, I did one and sent it to my friend Gail. Um, of him cussing. <laughs> I'm telling you, it's pretty funny when he cusses. Like <laughs> and that baby talk. Oh, and for those of you who ever saw the original movie Hangover, when the little crazy guy jumps out of the truck naked, uh, is that when he hollers it? When he says, tootaroo, blankety blank blank. Oh my god, that's what I said like that. Dave and I were Alan. I'm going to try to get Gail to come over and uh, hang out one night at the art room. Put some of the squiggly line. Yeah, I'm going to. I'm going to. I was just looking at that out of the back of my corner of my little eye. Yeah, I don't, I'm not, not feeling it, not liking it. It's just too, woohoo. Crazy. Too cray cray. This is something's got to happen over here. And I don't know what that something is. Maybe I'll do smaller bits of that. That's too much like that green. It's just like nothing is matching. Nothing's. I almost feel like I'm gonna whine about it, <laughs> but I won't do it. I'm not. I'm not a good whiner. I'm not a fan of the wine. Spelled with an H. Getting smaller and smaller. I don't know. Just glue it down. Quit the yapping. Start gluing. Ooh, come on. I'm like all thumbs tonight. I've lost my collage. Oh, shit. See what I mean? I lost my collage muscles. And I said shit again. That probably isn't good. <laughs> Somebody sent me a note one time that I need to stop using such language because she was trying to show a project I was doing to her kindergarten class. <laughs> Lady, you need to screen it first. Don't just jump in there. Bless her heart. Did I have a bigger circle? Can I get that to stick in there? I'm going to try. Something needs to happen in there. I like that um, die cut, but it's, it needs a little more action. See if that's going to stick with all those ups and downs in there. Hey, Kathy. Yeah, Z, I think I think you is right. 
my friend. Where can I put this little rascal? Can this help in here? I think I will. I hope nobody's news watching this because if, if they see this, oh, they would be running, running for cover. Now let's see how these have held up over time and what I can do with these. These are pretty thick. That's going to cut off of there pretty good. So let me do a strip. Well, where am I going to put it now? Well, let's just get her glued up and then wherever she drops, she drops. Because this would be kind of like those, you know, that same stuff I used to squirt on at the end and let it dry, that 3D stuff from Tulip. So it would just plop where it plops. So let's let it plop. I don't know why there calls to me, but there she is. Um, this is uh, the Tulip 3D stuff you get at Michael's. I just squirted it all over a sheet protector and whatever designs the white and black are in. Let it dry overnight and then come back and do two or three coats of... Um, matte medium over it so then it makes a skin that you can pull off and plop it where you think it needs plopping. I'm going to cut one in a different shape. And don't let it fold on itself because it will like permanently stick there. Hmm. I'm not feeling this tonight, I'm telling you. Did you ever have that happen? Where you sit down and you feel like you're using your two left hands or like something's not feeling right about the whole ordeal. Patty, we're, are we full for the art retreat? I, I think so, uh, Kathy. I'm waiting. Um, I was always told that 30 was my maximum, and I've never had 30. However, um, <coughs> it looked like it was going to go that way today. I got two new people today, and I had two other ones inquiring. And I emailed over at me tags and I said, hey, for my setup that we use, can I do 30? And I'm waiting on them to come back and looking at the seating chart. I don't think that's, I think that's going to be too tight. So, um, yeah, so we'll have to see. Oh. Uh, what they say when they get back to me. I don't I don't know where we put two more tables. That you could still see the screens pretty clearly. You know. Champagne the first night? Hmm, not a bad idea.
Maybe it should be the last night we drink to those that survived. Just kidding. This looks too thin. I don't know if I'm going to be able to pull this one. And this is the one I wanted. But I think, I don't think this is going to come off. I think this, I think this would have needed another coat of matte medium. Let me try to pull it up by piece of the black that I will sacrifice to get the skin going. Crap, Ola. Shoot. Ah. Yeah, that's going to have to have more matte medium put on it. I wonder if I have any more of that. Huh, hang on. What magical drawer did I find? Oh, here it is. Oh, looky here. Hang on. Look at what I found. whole lot of it. <laughs> that one feels too thin. Oh, there's a little hunk of white over. T oh, see, it's stuck on there. I bet it won't. Oh, no, it's starting to come off. Oh, come on. Work with me, Mama. Oh, it's too. Oh, no, it's a longer one. Oh, that one's kind of cool. This one would make me happy. To put over some of this crap. What crap shall I put it over? Oh, I don't like this. I really am not a fan. I wonder if I put it there. It's actually backwards. This is the bottom. I can cover it with thick grass. That streak of white going down there, maybe? Yeah, what the hell? Hey, Gala and Kathy, did you hear that Eileen's coming this year? I'm saving my, a special seat for her. I don't care if we're over the limit. I'm going to squeeze her. She's tiny. I can squeeze her in somewhere. Yeah, I always save the splats to last because then they got to dry. Can this pull off? I want some of this black. It's not. I don't know kind of matte medium I used on this, but it's not want to cooperate. And there's some good stuff on here. Some good squiggles. This one I'm not. Oh, 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 oh. Did that come off? Oh, <gasps> yeah. That's coming off. This is the matte medium, and I don't know which one it is anymore, that really can wrinkle up. Oh, that's coming off. No, I'm just saying that to try to intimidate her like she does with me streaming. Yeah, Patty's going to stream tonight when I have no intentions of streaming. I'm just saying Eileen's coming to the event. I personally think it would be an excellent idea. And this, I might go crazy and just go like diagonal somewhere with this. See what happens. What's the worst that can happen? One of the ladies let me know today that, um, and she really wanted to come, I feel bad, but they have a, a ser very serious illness in the family and she's not going to be able to get away, which if anybody gets that, I do. Um, I don't know, where am I going to put this? Like that?
This is kind of blah. That's kind of blah. Crap. <laughs> I should have cut it in half. Now I got too many fingers. Oh, hell with it. This is kind of screwed up from the get-go. So let's just... I don't want to cover up that... All that pink little circle there. That's my favorite thing is this tissue paper with the sparkly foil tops on it. Circles on tops. What the hell am I talking about? I think she should come. She's the one, Eileen is the one that actually told me about me tags. My tags, me tags, however the hell you say it. She's the one that told me about that because she had been there many, many times before. And uh, so I think, I really think it's on her to show up. I really do. I really, really do. I'm just going crazy here, cutting weird shapes down now, but I wanted that circle somewhere. That's kind of blah. That's still kind of blah there. I know, and you should, for all your online friends, and for me in particular, I think you should come this time. And, even though I'm going to get to see you in November again, down in Boca, I think you should come and see us up here. I do, I do. Oh, crap. I don't even know why I'm putting it there. I don't, I just, like, get it, make it be over. <laughs> That's how I'm feeling about this one. I am not feeling the love. I'm going to put a little, I got these little stripey things here. You can cut off this piece of matte medium. Doesn't really add anything. I really want Eileen to come because if she brings anything for the share table, imagine what she's got in her stash that she could bring. <laughs> it's all about what you can do for me, Eileen. I've like lost control now. I don't even know what the hell I'm doing. I don't know. I'm going to take another little hunk of this. And I'm going to leave the rest for another time when I have more of my sensibilities in order. <laughs> what the hell happened there? Get that little booger off of there. That's just going to cause me grief and heartache. I'm not sure I'm even going to put this one on YouTube. This one's kind of... Maybe I should. I'll show people what not to do. All right, where do I need a little hunk of black? Papa, Papa, Papa. Where are you going, Papa? I'm trying to imagine in my head where these are going to get chopped up. Oops, I don't want to cover up in pink circle. Think about it. Dumbass. Oops, I said dumbass. 
Okay, back away from the squiggles. No one to hold them and no one to fold them. I think I missed that lesson a while back. <laughs> hey. Let me get back and look at this at a distance, like maybe a mile and a half. Ay, ay, ay. Oh my gosh. The glue boogers are not good. All right. Now I think we might be ready to do some splots. Let's do this. Hey, gun. I can dry some of this up a little bit. <laughs> oh, I must have missed something. <laughs> but I do agree that Gala, there's something wrong with these people. But I don't know why. What prompted her to say it this time? <laughs> this will be take about 45 minutes for this to dry. I'm trying to think of what I want to splot. It's got gold in it. It's got silver in it. I don't know. My gut's telling me to throw some... Uh, rose gold watercolor at it. <laughs> oh, I think that conversation's taken a turn. <laughs> As did these, this collage going into ATCs. Lord almighty. I don't know if any of these will ever see the light of day. But sometimes they surprise you when you cut them up into the little pieces. CB says everything with a twinkle in her eye. Oh, hey, CB, I did that. Um, I, here's that pan of that water. Where the hell is the camera? That watercolor that dried. That new cougar red, I think of you every time I say it. Cougar red. That should be your screen name. Oh, you know what? Just had a little thought. But where are they? Hold on. Hold a phone. Sweet Jesus, I should have got up earlier. Oh, oh, oh. oh, mama. Talk amongst yourselves before I return. Let me see how my idea pans out. Let's see if this is still tacky enough. Maybe. I don't know. Hang on. What a phone. No, I want one with the... Ah, oh, crap. Ah. No, it's not what I want. I want one that's here. Maybe this has it on there. I'm looking for some of this gold foil, the simple gold leaf that's got the backing on it. And I just want to see, just for shits and giggles, 
This I think is still damp in here. Let me just do this. Huh. Huh. I don't know. Let's put some more stickums down. Where do I need to brighten it up a little bit? Could use a little something something up there. The whole friggin' thing. A little something in there. Right. Let's let that get a little tackified. I can't wait to see what you brought back, Sandra. I think you should bring it all to Maryland and do a show and tell one night. <laughs> now, where the hell did I put the glue? And I don't think I let it dry enough, but I want it kind of splotchy, so I'm like that. I can live with that. I just want it kind of funky. A little funky. Oh, hell, that's not funky. That's that's a, a big old blob. I'll have to get some of that off of there. There we go. And I put some down here somewhere, didn't I? Oh, hello. I also thought about anything to cover some of this up. These are the Mega Flakes called Royal Peacock. What if I just kind of like Found a little spot and like plop them in there. What if? And remember, these are going to get cut up, so it's not like I don't I don't care if one of them is rainbow and one of them is gold and one of them is silver. They're going to end up mostly on different cards. Tweezers. I need my twizzers. Oh, twizzers. Look at you with the pretty purple in there. Let's put you right there in the middle. You stay. I don't know if that might kill it, but we'll see. Crap, it turned over. Oh, that one is just gold. Never mind. Huh. Put the cap on these before I sneeze. If this is gonna, this matte medium is gonna mat this out, so it's not as shiny. I don't know what's gonna happen with it because that's not the stuff you're supposed to use. But at this point, what's the worst that can happen, really? I got enough on the brush. Ooh, that's a pretty piece stuck on there. <laughs> um. Where's my gold? Oh, crap. I didn't want it to do that. I want it little stripes. I'm not working. All right. Stop. <laughs> um. Be gone. This is very damp.
Yeah, I'm just using matte medium. That's what I had out. I'm not using the stuff you're supposed to use. So I don't know how that's going to work out in the long run. But at this point, I just want to make it stop. <laughs> These may never leave Cedar Drive. Make this cooler. So what I might do is some of the, um, oh, where the heck is it? Huh. Crap. I wonder what handy dandy little crevice my silver wide nib paint pen is. I don't know. I might have to use gold. I'll try that. I am going to cut it up. I can't, I, I can't stand it, Lena. I mean, I, I intended to cut it up. Some of them, when I get to this point, I hate to cut them up. This one, I can't wait to cut it up. Like, okay, make it stop. I'm not a fan of this one at all. All right, let's see what this is going to look like. That's kind of a crappy looking gold color. Do you guys have this? Remember this one I had in silver? It's like chrome. This one's like, well, it's drying down. It's a little metallic. I don't know. Let's put something here and see what happens. See how that dries. It's it's a little metallic-y now that this is drying, but it's not like that. It's not like that silver one, which is apparently somewhere in a safe place. If you'd seen my area, twice I've taken time off vacation days to come down here and clear it, and every time something happens that I never even make it down the basement. Hello, I need, people are going to be here. The end of July, and they're not going to be able to walk through the basement. Oh, you do, Bunny? Oi. Bless your heart. I want to try sometime making a, um, one of my Yupo pieces into um, cards, ATCs. That's shining a little bit more than I thought it would. See the gold up there? And maybe it's because it's still a little wet. Come on. Dry up, little fella. Yeah, I think that's still wet. It's dry on here. Yeah, it's just when it's dry, when it's wet, it's still shiny. That's not making me thrilled. Uh, I think I'm overshooting with anything thrilling at this point. At this point. I think we passed thrills. I'm going to put these brushes in water. Well, I can still try to save them. Um, okay, let's see. I had something. What could I have that I could shake some metallic? Oh, I know what it is. Is it right here? No, that would be water. 
I had a, um, oh, what the hell's her name? Um, one of the scrapbook vendors that has her own line, and she does the Minx foil thing, and she had a little spray, little sprays, metallic sprays. Uh, <laughs> I want to say Holly something, that's not right. My back's to the computer, by the way. I'm reading the labels on my drawers to find out where would something like that be. Yeah, I don't think it's anywhere around here, so I'm going to have to go another way. Silver. Oh, I wonder if these um, Brie Reese. I don't have a silver one now. I have just colors. And that glitter ink. Ah, uh, crap. Glitter ink. Huh. I've got about a thousand bottles of ink. Why is nothing hitting me? Acrylic, finest acrylic ink. Aereo Metallic. That's the one with the multicolors in it, I think. Let's see what this does. This is what I'm picking up. It's a Schmincke product. I think it's a, um, what do they call those? Air, uh, uh, air, uh, shit. You know what I mean. Air gun blue. What's that called? Oh my god, I'm totally blanking out. This one's called Aereo Metallic Brilliant Silver. Oh, that's the silver one. Hang on. I have another one called something else. It's like a multi. There's the gold. Here it is. This one's called Space. This one's got all kind of different, a little bit of different sheen in it, but that's what it is. I'm going to try throwing some of this at it. Hang on, i got to make sure that's not my boss texting me because I'm getting ready to travel. Nope. Airbrush. Hey, Jean. Thank you. Heidi Swap. There you go. Everybody's coming in with my Holly, Heidi. I was close. Not so much. Um, hey, Amelia. I'm making a mess tonight, my dear. Let's see what this looks like. This stuff wasn't cheap either. I don't know what wild hair made me decide to get that. Back in my Schmincke stage. Actually, I just ordered. Oh, and they came in. I have them upstairs, perhaps. They had a limited edition of Schmincke Metallics um, colors and golds. And nobody had them anymore. And I found, I just put it in Etsy to search for it. And one vendor had it and shipped them from Hong Kong. I just got them today, actually. Um, it's 18 half pans. And he didn't have the box they were supposed to come in. But I have a box I can put him in. But I saw him swatched on YouTube. And they're just as vibrant and bright on white paper as they are black. Is that ever going to dry? I want to see if I can tell what color it is. The board. What a mess this is. Huh. Yeah, it just looks like it's silver. That's not going to do it. Crap. Crappity crap crap. Where would, if you were a Holly Swap spray, where would you be?
And I think I just have the gold one. I think I only have one. Oh, well, I might as well give up the ghost on that one because we could be here all week looking for one little teeny weeny thing. Um, alcohol and people by silks. No, no, exclusive embossing plates, stamp carving, fabric paints, and embossing. Uh, distress inks. I've got so much distress stuff. Never, 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 never use it. Um. Oh, are you in here? Hang on. White. Red. I have a gold. This gold is pretty good. I'm going to call it a day and splash some of this around there. This is a, one of the Viva Decor um, <laughs> can't hardly see the label anymore. It's a gold ink. It's got a little shaker ball in there. Hey, Shauna. Oh, when I look at this on the screen where I can see more of it at that angle, I really don't like it. <laughs> Poor thing. It's going to feel like it's orphaned. Close your eyes, Jean. I'm not even going to take the time to do my little black and white dots and stripes and stuff on the black and white bits. I'm not going to do it. Heat gun. Yeah, I, I did YouTube Live. I tested it probably a year and a half ago, Gene, when it first was like going to be a thing. And downloaded the encoder and tried to get it all figured out. I remember testing it and I had no audio. And then I figured out somebody, it may have been you helping me, I don't remember. Uh, but it was something deep in a setting that I found. Um, and then it worked. But um, I never really used it. But um, Stacy Evans uh, emailed me and said that she would. Be happy to help me get set up now that you know it's easier than you think. I'm gonna have to because um, uh, this is gonna go bye byes unless you want to pay a hundred dollars a month to stream. August the first, adios, you stream. Free you stream, I should say. Oh, and it's no longer you stream. It's IBM Cloud Video or something. I forget. Yeah, I saw, uh, Gene, where it says that you can now um, save your chat. So when somebody, when you watch it back, you can actually see what was being said in the chat, which is kind of cool. Because a lot of people, when we do what we're doing now, you know, I don't remember every time to repeat what I'm answering. Because I get, you know, in the moment of what I'm doing, and, and I'm not, basically just not that smart. But, um, uh So it's you know it can be frustrating if you really are interested and want to know what some of these answers are that I'm saying, what the questions were, or or the links that you guys send out. Can you do links on um, uh, the YouTube chat, Gene? Do you know? Are you going to set up on YouTube, Gene? I know you always hated it. Right. It makes right, Debbie. It makes more sense. Puts it in context. I want this to dry enough that I can at least cut it up and see how bad it is. <laughs> individual cards. <laughs> yeah, I gotta figure out how to do that. That wasn't an option when I was playing with it. And I I I couldn't even repeat it now. I'd have to start from scratch because it's been so long ago. I have been on YouTube for a couple weeks. Oh, okay. See, you're on during the day when I have to go to my job and work. I always miss it. 
Every once in a while I sneak in there. I like how those dots hit those stripes right there. That's the part I like. <laughs> oh, yes. Come on, dry up, you little goomer, so I can see the damage in person. How do you like it, Debbie? <laughs> Bunny, you never know. It's funny, you know, when you do something and you personally don't like what you're doing, always somebody does like it. It like, I mean, somebody likes everything, right? Not everybody likes everything, but somebody likes everything. No. You know what I mean? There's going to be somebody out there that likes something that you think is crap. Because their opinion and their eye is different. I'm going to cut this up, um, Kathy, into ATCs. This isn't one piece. <laughs> it's getting all cut up. And I'll do it on camera if I can get these damn things to dry here. In time. What time? 721. I was hoping to be done by 730. Dave said, I'm guessing 8 o'clock. <laughs> I'll have to go back and look at your last uh, couple streams, Jean, and see how it looks. If I can see how, that it looks different to me, high HD wise. I'm thinking for the last few months, Ustream's been trying to piss us all off, so we just leave voluntarily. <laughs> oh, thanks, Dorothy. I like little teeny tiny windows of this, and they're very teeny tiny. I like that hot pink dot up here in that lime green. Come on. Dry up, you little rascal. Some of them up here are still soaking wet. Do you, either one of you guys have any trouble with trolls coming, when, cause you know when you're live, anybody can see that you're live on Ustream. I mean, YouTube. We're here for us, it's just like, you know, the link goes out sometimes to our followers. And not the whole world realizes that we're live and can pop in there and act like a, well, you know what, I probably shouldn't say it. Uh, the chat with the black background. Yeah, I should do that too, Jean, but I'm lucky I can get on and just do this every once in a while. And the only reason I did this tonight is because I'm literally out of ATC cards. I don't have another one to use. Yeah, I know you can kick them out, but you know how, Shauna, when, you're, when I'm working and I have my head down and I don't see it, unless you have moderators watching... Uh, you know, they can get in long enough to disrupt and act like an idiot. I mean, I'm not a saint or a prude, but I don't want somebody coming in acting all stupid and rude and, and you know, using language and stuff. Oh! Ah, reading, I'm reading Gay's, uh, oh Jesus, Lena's message, and uh, I'm not going to read it out loud, but <laughs> I don't know who that is, but I'd like to meet him. All right, we're going to call this. Done enough. No chat lag. I know. I remember when I did it, the chat it was a few seconds, but maybe three or three to five seconds, maybe. Oh, I don't know. I don't know who that is. 
G J is they're talking about. <laughs> I'll let this cool down so this gluey stuff kind of dries. I'm anxious to see. things are going to look like. Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, let's see. Okay, so they're three and a half tall, right? Three and a half tall. Cutting them down this way. Three and a half. And they're kind of fugly there in the middle. I don't see anything I'm loving there. So now I gotta decide do I want to lose the bottom or do I want to lose some of the top? I don't want to lose that. Huh. Well, let's see how much we got. Three and a half. It's just a little bit. Three and a half. No, nope. go this way. Well, let's do this. Let's just use, we'll use a sliver. No, oh, I like that kind of right there. Oh, hell with it. I don't think I'm... <laughs> I'm trying to save it, but I, I don't think there's, I don't think that's going to happen. That little bit doesn't look too bad. <laughs> okay, let's see what we got here. So I'm going to try to lose some of this in here because that's kind of bland. Uh, so let's go two and a half this way. Oh God, that's bland. I didn't, what's missing? I don't know. Something's not right. <laughs> Something not, not happening in the world of ATCs for me today. Well, I'm not going to lose that. That's for sure. Let me hack a little. So what do I have here? Six, two and a half, five. I'm going to lose an inch. So I'm going to lose a half. Hmm. I'll sacrifice that half inch, and I'll sacrifice that half inch, and then I'll cut this in half. I watch me have that damn two and a half. Don't screw up. I don't know, guys. <sighs> Not feeling it. Two and a half. Two and a half. Wow. I really forgot something, and I don't know what I, I don't know what I forgot, but it's. Not a good uh, ATC day, apparently. Yeah, there's like nothing happening there. Look at all that. It's like nothing. I've lost my collage touch. Three and a half by three and a half. Yeah, so I can lose an inch anywhere. Let's go here. Oh, I didn't even see you. I heard you, but I didn't see you walk by. You're very stealthy. You got poop with you? Huh? You got baby with you? I just took him out. Oh, did you? 
I thought if you brought Oakley down here, I'd try to set him up on my desk so the girls could see him. Are you still streaming? Yeah. I'm getting ready to wrap it up there. Okay. okay. Where do you do? Are you going to mow? Oh, okay. All right. I'll bring you a flashlight. <laughs> All right. So there's my pick of the whole thing. And that could use a little something, something. Okay. So this one's three and a half by three and a half again. So what do I want to lose? We're going to go this way. All right. Let's see what we got. I usually ride the tractor and Dave trims. Even after I ran the tractor through the fence that one year, bless his heart, I'm back on the tractor. <laughs> He is a cute little fart. Oakley, I mean, not Dave. Well, Dave's cute too, but it's one of the, that's where chat gets screwed up when you don't see the chat. Um, one of the girls just said Oakley's cute. He is cute. That's my favorite, I guess. Right there. These are. You know what I think I might do? I may come back over top of this. Now, I like that, but it's very, it's kind of plain. Like, it needs something. But I like the, the, tur the tur turquoise curve there. And the, I don't know. I think these need me to come back with some of the um, tulip stuff. And uh, I wonder if I could get Oakley down here. I don't know how I'd show him. I'd have to stand him on my desk, and then he'd see his back. Oh, I stuck his head underneath the camera. I may try to go get him if you guys want to hang on a minute. Oh, look, there's that hat. Let's move that so it looks like it's its own little thing. All right, well... Sadly, there it is. <laughs> I do think it needs a little something, something. But if anybody knows where this came from or how to get more of this, please tell me. It's tissue that came in some Happy Mail or something. I don't even remember. I love it. They must have more of those shiny little soikles. Okay, um, how can I go get this little turd? Uh, okay, talk amongst yourselves. I'm going to try this. If you hear a crash, it's me carrying him down the steps. So i got to either carry him or put his little booties on him. This is going to be a trick. Me sitting him on my lap and trying not to. He'll be eating all the ATCs. All right, come here, you little goomer. Oh, Lord have mercy. He's 40-some pounds. <sighs> Here's my puppy. Hey, Oak. Look up here. See the ladies? 
Say hi, Oakley. Hello, ladies. He's upside down and backwards. There's my puppy. There's my puppy. It's a very difficult camera angle. Don't eat the ATCs. That's bad. Dead bad. Where's my baby? Show me your pretty face. There your pretty faces. There's his pretty face. Where's my baby boy? And look, he got pretty doofies. Oh my goodness, look at those pretty doofies coming in. Where's the pretty doofies? There they are. You gotta keep your head up because you can't eat this stuff. You can't eat it. No, you can't. <laughs> That's my okie dokie do. That's my okie dokie. Yes, he is. Come here. All right, come on. Let's put you down. Oh, well, I can't put you down. I got to hold you. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> All right, guys. I got a ditch because I got 40 some pounds of puppy in my lap. I'm trying to keep his feet up off the ground. So thanks for hanging out. And I'll catch you on the flip.